Hey guys, how you doing? So, I don't even know where to begin with this. I don't. And a lot of you are not going to believe me anyway. And if you're a Christian that's just enjoying life, kind of lukewarm and just doing your thing, you're not going to believe me either. But, um, you know, that's then not my fault because I presented it to you and to the secular. AI. Christians get away from this stuff, okay? AI is demonic. It is not of the Lord. These kind of videos that you see right here, but they're talking about Christianity and we're all sharing them. No, don't do it. Don't do it. it you're being you're being fooled. You're being deceived. AI, AI is not even done being developed yet. They're actually still developing it. And corporations in America and around the world are using AI. They're now incorporating AI and using it. And in the last days, it does, it talks about the image and they worship the image and the beast gave the image, the power to speak. Be careful. AI is demonic. It is a modern day Ouija board. I can't tell you and talk enough about this stuff, but now we're all using it as Christians to share about Jesus. So AI now will show you what Jesus looks like because people are asking, what did Jesus really look like? Yeah, I'm just trying to warn you. Shocking AI predictions, okay? And everyone is drawn. Here's the thing. You're going to be enticed in the last days. You're going to be curious in the last days. You wonder how Eve took that fruit from the tree? She was enticed. And you all go, oh, that Eve. I can't believe she did that. Well, you're all doing it too. You're going to be enticed by imagery. You're going to be curious. You're going to be and then you're going to have, it's called seducing spirits that will seduce you into this kind of stuff. If you're not strong in your faith, you know, if you're not having that daily relationship with the Lord and walk with the Holy Spirit, ask the Holy Spirit what is true, what is false, you're going to catch up in this stuff. Be careful. I'm here because I've always been a person of warning because that's what the Lord gave me as my ministry, a warning to give to people warnings. You know, I didn't call for it. That was always upon me since the day I got saved. Warning dreams, warnings, tell my people. Um, so anyway, I'm here to let you know, stay away from this stuff. If you can get involved in it, that's you, up to you. That'd be your fault, not my fault. I just spread the word and share it. God bless guys. I hope you heed it.